afternoon, everybody. This is Karen Marge from Hilton Head Island, South Carolina. And I'm going to film Casper Goes to the Swamp. Now, in 1989, a Louisiana strawberry farmer named Blay Hutt recovered a clutch of alligator eggs as part of a statewide program to hatch a layer, a larger percentage of alligators. Two of those eggs hatched albino alligators, the only two known to man. Now, Mr. Blay Hutt then recovered more eggs in 1991 and hatched five more albino alligators. And in 1995, Alligator Venture purchased all seven albino alligators. Now, the legend from the bayou is that old timers told many mysterious stories about these ghosts of the swamp. It still remains a Cajun superstition that a lifetime of good luck comes to any person that's seen these swamp ghosts. Now check this out, this is absolutely amazing guys. Now I've been down to the St. Augustine alligator farm, uh, but they have the smaller uh, alligator and they also have some baby ones swimming around, but this is the biggest albino that I've ever seen and this is unbelievable. And if you look at the beautiful eye, how you know it's a true albino is if it's got pink in the eye area uh, because sometimes animals can have, I think it's uh, pronounced leucistic, a true albinoism. They'll be mostly white or cream color and then definitely have pink around the eye area. All right, guys, we're signing off live. I'm at the Alligator Adventures in North Myrtle Beach, and these are spectacular reptiles. Have a great day.